What's up, Patio Takes? It's another late night. Um, just did water change earlier, and I uh, just want to give you guys an update of what changed around, what is going on. I think I might just have to split this tank in half because I did buy another fish. I couldn't resist another Mark 80, 87. Just letting y'all know, I couldn't resist another Mark 80. Seven. But I'm trying to buy another tank for this guy over here because I moved. I moved him here. It is long enough, but do I really want to do that? That's kind of janky right there. But uh, I moved him here. I moved the fly. I mean, I moved the goldfish from this tank to here. I don't know if I showed you guys last time, but I did buy these two goldfish new goldfish i moved a bunch of goldfish uh, i took a bunch of goldfish to my uncle as i already said in my last video um yeah i think this is nice for me to view and just um slowly work with it um i enjoy this a lot i enjoy this a lot more because when i had i think i took like six or seven to my uncle and um, this tank was filled with a bunch of goldfish. It was a little harder to, to keep track of or just to look because it got so overcrowded. It was, I had to keep feeding because it wasn't enough for everybody to eat and the tank got dirty fast because I had to do water change every single day. And knowing these goldfish, they have very, very high pneumonia spikes. So um, I think this is, this is a lot better, just keeping it to this. Uh, maybe um, if they're able to breed in the in the future, I'm trying to breed. Um, I'm trying to see if these ranchus are able to breed by themselves. I might buy a few more. These are randas. I'm trying to see if they are able to come out more like this. This is fine for me. I might buy a few more. I do have two ponds. If I don't buy any koi's, I'm going to wait in the spring and have two ponds and try to see if they breed in there as well all right um i don't know if i told this guys i don't i don't know if i told you this guy's name his name is mark 22 if you guys are into iron man or any of that check mark 22's outfit out it is amazing um it fits in very well a lot of black a lot of red a little bit of orange i know this dude has um a two-tone that's very beautiful but um he matches that name a lot he matches that costume he matches that outfit mark 22 this dude is amazing welcome to the team um iron heart i call this dude iron heart why i don't know he just looks like a heart shape to me i saw this fish at the NorCal competition, what two? I think this April, this this spring, 2022, this spring, and I was really, really interested in this fish, but um, I couldn't get my hands on it due to personal reasons. But then I finally got my hand on this fish because a friend had it and he was selling it for cheap because he wasn't trying to breed anymore. And this is a ZZ fish or a Zinzu. It's a type of Zinzu. It's it's an Endo Zinzu. Um, and I've, I've always wanted to keep one and he was, he happened to be for sale at the moment. And I just scooped him up real quick. The moment he posted up, I bought it because I've, I, the moment I saw this fish, I was asking around to see if it was for sale, but owner wasn't there at the competition. So, um, finally got the, my hand on this guy. I'm beefing him up. He's beautiful. He's an amazing, amazing looking fish. I love him. A lot this thing called him iron heart and here is mark 85 right here beautiful as ever um the only thing that kind of sucks about him now is that his flower horn line is kind of gone now because he's gone so big he's probably around like nine inches already i don't know he's super big nine to ten inches He's a really big fish. He's bigger than my freaking iPhone 6. Uh, iPhone 12 Pro Max. Um, but yeah, he. I think he does amazing in this black background tank. 
I think I thought that he was gonna get scared and stressed and turn dark like a lot of other fish when they get into a black background but he's actually uh pretty nice his bread comes and go but I think that depends on how often I do water change because I only have one sponge filter in there I'm probably planning to get another air pump like this one over here air pods AirPod, because this one works really strong so i might get one exchange it out and uh do two sponge filter maybe three in here just enough for him to get um enough filtration or um airflow i don't know he, this dude likes to stay in very very clean even though he poops a lot he eats a lot and all these stuff and um it's too dark i am i'm not even gonna show you guys too dark i'll show you guys how the pond looks like on the other side next morning because it is late it's midnight just got done doing a water change earlier um but this is my setup for right now i do have a new fish coming in like how i said earlier um this looks exactly just like this guy right here if not you guys call them twins mark 80 i'm gonna call them mark 80 86 maybe 86 or 88 i don't know they look just exactly alike but i'm gonna have them both in this tank because they're freaking identical freaking identical um yeah we'll end the video in the next morning i'll see you guys in a few seconds all right and we are back good morning let me record this real quick before i go to work um but look at how red mark 85 is in the morning he's always super red in the morning he's amazing in the morning but yeah let me show you guys this guy right here he's beautiful to me he's beautiful he's probably not the best srd looking but I like this because he's he looks so much like a confa a thick body hard coke a nice fins and tails um yeah that's my kind of srd now i mean i really like like that but i like this too damn this coke got big overnight <sighs> let's go Okay, so this is the new setup um it's freaking freezing oh well, it's not cold, freezing but it is pretty cold um i've had this going on for like a, a week now um i might be picking up koi's to put in here uh, but i don't know yet we will see because i do just kind of want to let it sit until spring um so i could throw in the goldfish in here back in here same with this one over here too but i do have a sunfish in here too um it's probably hiding under these plants yeah well that is it for t patio tanks i just wanted to show you guys the new setup for out outside how it looks like during the day um because you guys probably always ask why do i film at night because i got the lights at night all the fish look amazing at night besides mark 35 because he looks good in the morning as well too all right patio tanks is out see you guys in the next video